Hey everyone, VT and Kiwi back again with another Forza Horizon 5 Forza Thon, and this week we need to own and drive the 2013 Formula Drift number 777 Chevrolet Corvette. We then need to earn 6 stars at Drift Zones, we then need to earn 10 Ultimate Drift or E-Drift skills in it, and then lastly we need to earn 100,000 points at Drift Zones within 2 minutes. Should be simple enough, you can do that in one Drift Zone. Uh, my daily is just earn an ultimate burnout skill in any Peugeot, Holden, or HSV, another Holden, at the Stadium Lunar Drift Arena. Um, Santa PR event, uh, actually no, three drift zones, nice and easy. Um, event lab stuff, not the greatest. Um, snapshot, nice and easy. You just go to that drift zone at either of the starting points and take a photo of your car, I had a look around to see if I could spot the lantern dragons in the distance or whatever because that's what's in that photo there and I found it so I took a snapshot of my car at the start with that in it um, and that got it for me, I don't know if it's required but anyway. Now this one, frog in the well you need to drive an Austin Healy Sprite and it talks about something like um, walking the plank or something like that, and um, like jumping five times or whatever. So I just used the Austin Healy Sprite, and I did the the danger sign called Boardwalk, because it um because it was the one in the swampy area on the right hand side of the map, and it's the most similar thing to walking the plank type of thing, Boardwalk. I did that once. I don't even know if I got three stars on it, and it gave me the um, completed the challenge for the treasure hunt, and it let me see where the treasure was which is in the um, cave by one of the ruins where one of the um, bonus boards are, which is in the photo there. Um, Forzathon shop. The Ferrari F50 GT, very nice. Grab that if you don't already have it, and same as the Formula Drift Ferrari. That's actually the, the Ferrari that I used to do the drift zone um, PR event Swift because it's S1 class and it was one I already had a tune on for Max of S1. And this week's rewards is the Hyundai Kona 2022. It's a new car, I believe it's new to Forza, not just new to this game. And then the Wooling Sunshine, which has been in the game, um, it was added to the game a little while ago. And it's a crazy D class car, a front wheel drive, you can get over a thousand horsepower in it. And it's nuts uh, for D-Class. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. Welcome back, Brayden. A new Z car. Mm, I didn't realise I had two. It's definitely a fun car. I just had to make sure. Just going to restart the game because I noticed it felt and looked like trash.
<sighs> That's much better. It definitely already seems a lot smoother. Welcome back, Brayden. Drift zones. Hundred thousand points of drift zones.
How did that person on my friends list get that car already? Yeah, there's no option to buy it, so... Seems a bit dodgy. Anyway, let's get into a Holden. Daily done. Cool. And uh, that is going to conclude this week's Forzathon. So. That's going to wrap it up. Thanks for tuning in. Hope you guys found it helpful. If you did, you know what to do. Follow, subscribe, all that good stuff. Um, drop a comment on stuff you guys would like to see me do new, see me do next or things you think I could do better with. Or just to pop in and say hey. And I hope you're all having a great day or great night wherever you are. Peace out. Have a good one.